what's going on? It's Amy again with Bargain Mama. And, excuse me, today is Monday. And it has been one heck of a Monday. Um, the one, so we have a group message, I guess, at work that, um, I guess now instead of intercoms and stuff like that, we text in the group, hey, can you come help in this room? Can you come help in this room? And um, apparently one of the therapists dropped somebody's dentures down the drain and needed somebody to come take apart the drain. I was like, that is a new one. That And that was like the third text that person had sent through. So they were having one heck of a Monday. I just thought that was funny and I had to share it with you. Like when you're seeing your phone and it says like, can somebody please alert maintenance to come to room whatever, um, somebody's dentures fell down the drain. I was like, that's a bad Monday. But anyways, with that being said, I just wanted to come on real quick. I wanted, so following this is going to be a walkthrough at the Dollar Tree. And I did already upload this morning and I usually upload once a day. But I did just want to give you a little sneak peek of what I found at the Dollar Tree in this walkthrough because let me tell you, I found some amazing stuff. One of the things I found that obviously I had to get, so some of this stuff you will see in my haul. Um, oh, no, I can't. Um, hourglass pens. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Hourglass pens. It was so cute. Just gorgeous things that I had not seen before, so I was very excited. Anyways. So following this is going to be the walkthrough of that. Tomorrow will be the haul from that. I just don't have time to do the haul tonight. But also, I just wanted to get like everybody's opinion. So yay, I have hit 500 subscribers. I am so ecstatic. I did wait a little while after my 500 just because sometimes I'll be like at 500 and then I'll be like at 480 and then I'll be like at 503 and then I'll be like at 450. I don't know. So I wanted to wait a little while, but I have been holding pretty steady at above 500 for a couple days now. So I'm really excited because next month hits my one year. So I'm very excited to hit 500 in less than one year. With that being said, I want to just kind of get everyone's opinions instead of just assuming what people want for the 500 subscriber giveaway. Um, so I was thinking a couple different things. Um, I was thinking a $50 um, Dollar Tree gift card. $50 Michaels gift card, because I love crafting, um, a $50 Hobby Lobby gift card. So those are kind of the three different um, gift card options. And then I was thinking, well, gnomes is a big thing right now. So I was like, well, if somebody maybe wants a gnomes giveaway and I can run around and try to find as many gnomes as I want from like TJ Maxx, Hobby Lobby, all those things. Um, I could do a makeup giveaway, find different makeups and do that. I could do, um, a crafting giveaway well I just went and bought a lot of crafting stuff for everyone and threw it in a container and sent it I guess um, I had one more in my mind I could do like a stationary one I guess like pens paper I don't know these hourglass pens might go in no matter what because they're so cute um, any and any other ideas anyone has please let me know please comment below and let me know I am going to do it <coughs> Excuse me. So next week I do go down to four days a week at one job so that I have a little bit more flexibility with my time with my home health patients. So I probably will not um, gather the items or whatever until or even do the giveaway until next week. But I just wanted to get an idea and I'm going to post this on a couple of my videos so that I can get ideas from several of my videos. Um, so yeah, just let me know what you guys want because you guys are who got me to 500. I can't even believe it. I remember in April of last year, well, first of all, in March of last year, so we have made it through one year, and I'm sorry for the people who haven't, but I remember a year ago sitting in one of the therapy gyms and seeing all this stuff all of a sudden post that my son wasn't going back to school, and I was like, what the heck? I'm going to be honest. I don't watch the news a whole lot. I usually try to be a pretty upbeat person. I feel like every time I watch the news, it's something sad or whatever, so I stick to the Golden Girls. Everybody loves Raymond. King of Queens, things like that. So I really had not much idea what was going on except for what people were talking about. And it kind of reminds me of that song, um, Where Were You When the World Stopped Turning? It really, really reminds me of that because it, it just insane. But we made it through. I'm sorry. I'm very sorry for those of you who have not or have loved ones who haven't. But so that happened in March. In April, I said, you know what, Amy? 
like I, I did not stop working. Other people stopped working and did all this, but I needed something to take my mind off of it. Like I just, I couldn't do it. And I really, um, wasn't going out and doing a lot. So I started watching YouTube and I was like, this is really fun. Like, I love this thing. I had never really gotten on YouTube before to be honest. Um, and so my son was always on it. I'm like, what are you always watching that thing for? Like, you need to get off. And now my son's always like, mom, why are you always on that thing? Get off. So it was just kind of funny. But so yes, last April, I said, this would be kind of fun. It'll take my mind off of all the stress going on, all that stuff. And I just kept going. Like, this is probably the longest I've ever stayed with something, to be honest. I absolutely love it. Um, it is definitely stressful. You know, people are not very nice, but you know, that's, they might, maybe something is wrong in their life. I'm not sure. But anyways, um, I'm not going to keep you on here very long now that we're five minutes in, but watch my walkthrough amazing items. Please comment and just tell me even if it wasn't one of my suggestions, what people would like. Um, yeah. I mean, even if it's somebody wants a $50 gift card to like Texas Roadhouse or a restaurant or something, you know, to go out, let me know because that could definitely be in the running too. And it's not going to be like a vote. I'm going to look at all these ideas and I'm gonna be like, that's the thing. That's what I think I'm going to do. So if you have a unique idea or a great idea or something, let me know. And that could be it. So everyone, I hope you're having a great Monday. I am going to upload this right now. And um, yeah, I will talk to you guys later. Bye guys. It's too quiet in here guys. So I just have to show you this. not only do we have what I just showed you look at this mini puzzle that is beautiful that is so pretty and we have this one it's so cute and this one but this is what drew my attention look at this so cute a dollar for name brand they expire August of 2021 they are 10 fluid ounces. <laughs> Dreaming of space. And then, you guys, like, I have to show you these. I'm gonna get them anyway, so you'll see them in the thing. They are hourglass pens. Look at them. Guys, this is so cute, and it's like, the material is so soft. So there's that one. This beautiful unicorn. These beautiful bracelets that come in two. I love the colors. And then, look at this pen. It's Mickey, but... Yeah. A lenticular pen. Name brand Puffs. 96 two-ply sheets. And look at this rainbow. You would think it's a squishy because they have squishies. It doesn't show up very good, but it's a light. And here is another light. How beautiful they're light. They're not the squishy toys, and they're pretty big, guys. I don't know why it says a glow in the phone thing, because it looks like it goes on your... I don't know, but it's so cute. So there it is. Oh, I guess you scan it, and that moves onto your phone. That's cute. So this is a wand, but then you scan it, and that puts it on your phone. No lemons, but we have the limes. Okay, guys, I don't know who Juncture is. Let's see, is it Greenbrier? Yeah, Greenbrier. But look at these bright green ones. They're so cute with popsicles. Hold on. They have watermelon. They have dogs. I'm gonna get the dogs, I think. These ones. These bright colored ones. Let's see. Some more back here. Um, I think those are the same as the front, but these I think are my favorite. I have to get them, I feel like. I didn't realize it, guys. It says the lollipop ones say just chill. That's kind of funny. And obviously they have to be new masks because is anyone else seeing what I'm seeing? The emojis, you guys, have a mask on. Oof, I don't know how some people are going to feel about that.
And just like the previous years, they have the straight flat ones. I do like those. And they are pretty sturdy, so they have them here in white and black. And my back with socks. Watermelon. Some cats. Just a bunch of fun colors. Llamas. Dogs. These are the ankle ones though, guys. Some rainbows. Okay, I think that's all of the different ones and I'm about to drop the whole rack.